Okay, we are going to do some basic chords. We are going to do G, C, A, and D. So we'll start with G. When playing the G chord, well, when playing any chords, with your fingers, this finger is one, your middle finger is two, and your ring finger is three. So when I'm referring to your fingers as numbered, that is which ones they are. So you take your third finger in the third fret on the bottom string. And then you take your second finger in the third fret to the top string. And your first finger fills in on the second fret on the second to top string. G. All right, then for C. C, your first finger goes in the first fret on the second to bottom string. And then your second finger goes in the second fret on the third from the top string. And your third finger goes in the third fret on the second to top string. The ring got in the way there. Um, with this, you have to kind of tilt your hand so they're not straight up and down. They're kind of tilted. My thumb is sticking out the top because my wrist is moved towards the front so that I can reach all the way over here. All right, now we'll go to A. Third finger is going to go on the second to bottom string in the second fret. Your second finger goes on the string next up and then your first finger goes on the string above that. So you have three fingers in a row all on the second string, uh, second fret, starting on the second string. Then we will do D. D starts with your first finger on the third bottom string in the second fret. Second finger on the bottom string in the second fret. And your third finger goes in between, so it's on the second string in the third fret. There you have G, C, A, and D.